Hey everyone, Technomancer here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to screenshot on your iPhone 10 in a few different ways. So let's get started. Now the simple and the easy ways is going to be using the buttons. You're going to locate the volume up buttons, which is right under the ringer switch and this big side button. So what you need to do is perfectly time by pressing these two buttons at the same time and letting go. Just like that with your fingers, this usually helps. And then from there on, you'll see a screenshot at the bottom corner. You can tap on it to make changes such as cropping it, marking it up using these tools. And then once you're ready, you can go ahead and click on the share icon to share. And then you can put in the trash if you don't like it or if you're done with it and simply want to save it to photos or files, you can select, click on done and then save it to photos and it's going to save it to your photos album. So that's going to be one way. Now, let's say for some reason, maybe you can't get it to time it perfectly or it's not working. Another way to do it is using Siri. So in your settings, you need to ensure that Siri is turned on and listening. And all you'll say is, hey, Siri, take a screenshot. And right there on, Siri can help you take a screenshot. Same exact thing. You can mark it up, crop it, whatever you need to do. And once you're done, click on done and then save it to your photos or files apps as well. So that's gonna be another way. Now let's say you don't wanna use either of this method or they're not working. Another method is by going into your settings, you're gonna to wanna to go to accessibility and then click on touch and then scroll all the way down to back tap. So you're gonna tap on back tap and then you can click on either double or triple, but basically you can activate action by double tapping or triple tapping on the back class of your iPhone. So you need to select screenshot here and from here on go back to verify that that and then basically what happens is now whenever you're holding a phone and you double tap like I did on the back class it will automatically take a screenshot for you which you can go ahead and do the same exact thing. You have to make sure there isn't a case or something blocking it but basically it allows you to take a screenshot as long as you double tap uh, and it does take some practice to get hang of it. So as you can see here, sometimes it works. It doesn't work sometimes that great. But those are different ways to take screenshot on your iPhone. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.